Hey everyone, it's technology expert Burton Kelso here with another tech tip to help you get the most out of the technology in your life. Today we're talking about how to use ChatGPT to make money. ChatGPT has been around since November of last year and it has exploded over the internet. People are looking into this new AI interface in order to help grow and maintain their business. Now let's say that you're looking to do something a little different. You can definitely turn to ChatGPT to make money. Now the interface is pretty simple. You can visit it at chat.openai.com and visit or forward slash chat and visit the website to create a multitude of things. The website will give you examples of things that you can put in as input the capabilities of those examples and of course the limitations and keep in mind that you've got a paid version of chat GPT and a free version now it would probably be in your best interest to get the paid version because the free version only rolls out when there's space available on their servers now before we jump in about making money with chat GPT you have to understand that the AI uses human language and will output things in human language, but you definitely don't want to rely on chat GPT to produce stuff that you can immediately post on the web or use as your own content. You never know where chat GPT will gather information as it's designed to scour the internet for any content that could help your query, but at the same time that content can be copyrighted and so the idea is to use it in a way where it will help your creative juices flow better also with it being machine based you want to add your own personal style to the queries that chat GPT will generate that way it will be relatable rather than just the machine generating content so how can you make money? Well, there's a lot of different things that you can do and let's go through them. So the first would be you can create email titles, content and campaigns for those emails. One of the challenging things about emails is how do I word that email? What is going to be a title that is going to capture my audience? And ChatGPT can definitely do that for you. Rather than typing in examples, I'm going to leave it up to you to go to the website and type in anything that you want where it concerns email content, titles, and specific campaigns that you can roll out. Some examples that I can give to you would be, how do you create an email campaign that's going to get back old customers? How do you create an email campaign that is going to allow you to showcase your products in a way that is going to attract new buyers or new customers same thing with the service business how do you generate emails that's going to get customers to want to use your services look to chat gp to chat gpt to make that happen for you and it will help the process or help you get started in the process of getting those emails going the next thing that you can do in order to make money using chat gpt is Build content for newsletters and blog posts. One of the most challenging things that I have to deal with is coming up with content for a weekly blog. Now, fortunately with technology, there's always something going on in the technology world that I can blog on or create a newsletter for. But for a lot of industries, sometimes that's slow moving. Whether it be real estate, plumbing, HVAC, you name it, restaurant industry, it can be a challenge to create content. Now, you want to create content such as newsletters and blogs in order to give a value add to the information that you're sharing with your customers and potential customers. No one wants to be sold to and in this day and age, we're seeing a lot of that with email and other posts. You want or you can use ChatGPT to bring up ideas of what you can build upon as far as content for your blog post or your newsletters. Again, you don't want to go to chat GPT 
type in your query as far as what would make a great blog post or a newsletter and immediately post that to the web. This information may be copyrighted that ChatGPT uses and you want to keep yourself safe from stealing interle uh, intellectual property and uh, more importantly, a lawsuit. Next, you can definitely use ChatGPT for copy for websites. Again, depending on your industry, it can be hard to generate copy for your websites. And I think that's the most things that people struggle with, especially if you're using site builder tools such as Wix, Squarespace, or Shopify. It can be hard to come up with your design, but also generating copy too. Now, most instances, people would tell you, well, just have a web designer design it for you. But a lot of web designers can't come up with the copy as they're in the design phase only and then you would have to hire a copywriter to do it for you which isn't a bad idea but if you're trying to keep your costs low you can use chat gpt to come up with the proper copy for your website and hopefully the right seo to use in order to gain more clicks on your website what about social media? ChatGPT can help with that too, as I know many of you struggle with your social media post. If you go to ChatGPT, you can type in a topic or just have it generate a, a social media post that would pertain to your industry. One of the other time sucks when it comes to running a business and marketing the business is staying active on social media. So why not turn that duty to ChatGPT and have it come up with some of the content ideas that you may want to post on social media. Now, remember, social media is a people centric tool. You want to keep your post human related. So therefore, scrutinize what the output of ChatGPT is and make sure that it's going to appeal to the human side of your followers because they're following you because they want to be entertained and they want to see the human side of you. Our next, or I shouldn't say our, cause it's just me. Next, you can use ChatGPT to create um, content for online courses and tutorials. And the reason you would want to do this is just for the factor of time. It takes time to generate content for online courses and tutorials for different products. Let's say that you developed a app or program. You need to have a manual that goes along with that or people are probably aren't going to use your content. So turn to ChatGPT just to take some of the stress out of content generation um, for manuals, eBooks, because it can be a challenge and it can take a lot of time to generate that stuff. Next, if you're a podcaster, you want to or can use ChatGPT to generate scripts for videos and audio content. <laughs> Luckily, doing this live video, I can come up with this stuff off of the top of my head. I'm fortunate in that aspect that I'm just teeming with information where I don't necessarily have to write a script for all of these live videos that I do. But there are some of you that may be a little camera shy if you're getting started or you just, I shouldn't say not familiar with your product, but sometimes not able to find the right wording for specific text for videos and even audio that you're doing for your YouTube videos or even your podcast. Let ChatGPT help you out in this instance and therefore you can free up or have more time to do the things necessarily to run your business, but be able to market your business with podcasts and videos at the same time. Next is, ha, I like how I brought that up again. That ain't what our next tip is. I was bragging on myself about um, all of this stuff. But uh, let's go and talk about our next topic, which is really content for media pitches. So much for bragging and going live saying I'm able to do this on my own. But media pitches are excellent because if you are looking for free media attention, meaning that you want to be on a podcast or on a on radio TV, you can definitely use chat GPT to generate that information so that you don't you can 
find the right words to use if you are planning to be an expert on any media platform out there. Next, let's talk about the developing of chatbots or virtual assistants. Now, this is kind of a tricky one. Understand that ChatGPT can uh, develop chatbots and virtual assistants, but this isn't for the non-techie person. But if you have a little tech skills, this is just an idea that they're out there, that there are businesses out there that would love for you to develop chatbots or even virtual assistants that are able to interact with a business's customer base. If you get into the deep of ChatGPT with the combination of using the platforms on OpenAI, you can definitely build chatbots and virtual assistants that would help any business out there. And even further, you can use ChatGPT to actually build applications. If you wanted to get started with an app for your business or help other businesses develop apps, look no further. ChatGPT definitely can help you out with that content as far as building apps and making it a little bit more easy for you to do. Now, I'm side-eyeing here because I'm like, did I miss something? And I don't think I did. I think I covered it all. So with that said, if you've got comments or questions or ideas of things that you can do with ChatGPT, leave them in the comments section below. Would love to hear from you to find out what things that you think that you can do with ChatGPT. And with every video, I always am asking, shouldn't say beg, but asking, if you like this video, be sure to like it, comment on it, and share it with your friends. Because I know that you know people out there that struggle with technology and need some help. My goal with technology is almost like that of ChatGPT, which is to open you up to a whole new world of ideas and experiences so that you can achieve your goals in life. I love technology. I've read all the manuals and I'm serious about making technology fun, safe, and easy to use for everyone. So take care of yourself and do many things to make you smile. And thanks for watching.